let's add one more thing here just to show you one of the cool features of Jersey. So right now we're doing all of our work with application XML. Our get is returning XML and our put is consuming XML. Um, it's very easy with Jersey and the JaxB framework. Um, JaxB is, is what we're using to, uh, to um, serialize our words. Um, this XML root element on our word class is a, is a JaxB or Java XML um, um, annotation. Um, so with JaxB we can very, and Jersey we can very easily add application JSON to what we produce and in the put we can add application JSON to what we consume and now if I redeploy this let me close these old windows so we'll go here and I've got a nice uh, JSON definition of a BTI right here expert collaborative engineer we should all be living that out so I'm going to go ahead and put that with JSON we'll paste that in here so we got no response which is what we expect a 200 status code so now let's try and do a get with BTI expecting application JSON back and here we've got a JSON representation of our um, BTIR word resource with the definition expert collaborative engineer and name BTIR. And of course, we can still retrieve the XML representation of that same resource. There you have it. So over the past 13 minutes, we've gone through, we've, we've um, accomplished several different requirements. We've been able to build a RESTful web service. We can do basic CRUD operations. Um, we can do a little bit of error handling. There'd still be a lot more to build in if this was a, were a production system. Um, and we can do both XML and JSON. So that's just a brief introduction to the power of Jersey and JaxB and building Java REST web services. Um, all this code has been checked into Project Orange Storm. Um, and uh, feel free to go and check it out and download it and play around with it. I um, hope you enjoyed the presentation. See you soon. Bye.